Aloha. Hey, I'm Johan Van Arde, and I'm a business mentor, social entrepreneur, and business mentor doing online branding, marketing, and mindset training, as well as a social entrepreneur network marketer. And I help uh, entrepreneurs get more leads online, uh, recruit more leaders, uh, learn to brand themselves, um, leverage themselves through virtual assistant services, and improve their mindset. And of course, help them to become a top earner. So, but I really want to give this training to you, and that's my four reasons how you can best serve your future client. Now, a lot of people. Would, would would talk about a future client as as a prospect. I like to look at people always as my clients. And whether you're network marketing, whether you sell a product or a service, I like to look at people as a client. And um, But you need to do the right things with your future client to really help them. Because ultimately, guys, at the end of the day, it is going to be always about serving the needs of your client and their wants because needs and wants are two different things but serving them and doing what is best for them and when you do what is best for them and give them value in a product or a service or an opportunity then you will make money so I'm gonna go into the first of four right here so the first thing that you want to do with your client is a process called discovery. Now, of course, when you prospect somebody for network marketing, you're going to reach out and ask the question, are you open to any side projects to earn extra income if it doesn't interfere with what you're currently doing? Or if you're selling a virtual assistant service like I do, is do you need help outsourcing parts of your business so you have more time to do the important things? Whatever the, the answer is, to, you know, whatever the question is that you're asking, or for the product or service you're selling, when you get a positive answer, do not resist the temptation to go into the sale, so to speak, and just start telling them all about your product or service. Instead, find out why are they curious? Why are they interested? What is important to them? And we call it a process of discovery. When you discover what's important to them, then you would get to know, you know, things about their family, their occupation, their transition, if they, you know, own a house or rent, you know, what's their education like, what are their kids into or their siblings into, what do they do for fun and recreation, and what is their lifestyle like, and, and what would this product or service specifically do for them. Also, people like to talk about themselves, right? And so when people talk about themselves, they warm themselves up towards you. <laughs> it just is. People say to me, I like you, you're a good guy, and I don't know anything about you, you know? And it's always good to tell a little bit of a story, but the very first important thing that you need to do is to discover what is the most important to your clients so you can match your product and service to their needs. Anyway, go grab that daily Aloha Laptop Lifestyle Cheat Sheet. It's four simple steps that you can practice and do on a daily basis that will also let you love your version of an Aloha Laptop Lifestyle and build your business toes in the sand or your version of that. Take care, Aloha, and God bless.